Okay, so this one I put a lot of the um first one is the sapphire. Blue. Okay. It's the still, first two is a sapphire blue, and then the last one is a boom. Mixed, yeah. Royal royal blue and sapphire. So this Let me give you a close-up look so that you guys can reminisce on this, man. Come on, man. Hey. Welcome back to another video! Let's go! Of Activerse Universe today is the new day! And we got a what? We got a banger! Banger! Vibe check, vibe check, okay, okay. But I'm here to announce that we about to hit 20K! 20K, guys! Let's get it! So for 20K, guys, I'm doing something special for you guys, and that is reviewing your guys' dreadlocks. But listen to this, I'm only picking 10 subscribers, okay? 10 of y'all. Y'all need to go DM me and let me know this is my dreads and this is what it looked like, this is how I started, whatever it is. And send me pictures and videos so I can rate your dreadlocks. And I'm going to categorize you in a 10, in the top 10. If you made it in the top 10, just know that you have the top 10 dreadlocks as a subscriber, you know. And that uh, don't get offended if I put you on the 10th because, you know, I'm going to put the number one number one for me, you know what I mean. I have a second, second, second surprise for you guys, which is I'm going to be giving you guys, YouTubers, the YouTubers that are doing dreadlocks, another chance to get on my intro, doing my intro. I'm, I'm going to be posting you on my upcoming videos. I don't know if you guys seen my 10 10k subscribers time but i gave people a chance is it 10k dang it was 10k yeah when i hit 10k i gave people a chance to basically do my intros so i can put them in the front of like in the beginning of the video and i put their links in the bottom description so if you guys want to get into that and you guys have a youtube channel make sure you dm me and send me a video and telling me that you know this is my intro here you go and then send it to me you gotta pass the whole vibe check you feel me and you can't be like welcome back to another video of activeverse universe you know I don't want that. Give me one more chance, and I promise I won't miss up ever again. I want you to be like, Welcome back to another video! Oh, he brought them in their mother's womb. Can somebody, can somebody, huh, just tell your neighbor, 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 huh, gonna bring them in their mother's womb. Can somebody, huh, just tell your neighbor, 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 huh, God knew you before, huh, you was in your mother's womb. You know what I'm saying? Make the whole house shake. Make you know what I mean? I want you to go crazy on that intro. If not, you won't be making it to my video. But here is another chance for you, man. For you, you are a YouTuber. You will make it. You will gain subscribers. So hey, make sure you do that so I can help you YouTubers out. You don't have to have dreadlocks. You don't have to have whatever. Like you could be doing anything. But as long as you have a YouTube channel, please send me that video. And if you don't have a YouTube channel, you still want to send it to me. I'm gonna give you the opportunity. If you pass the vibe check, I'll. Definitely Definitely plug you in in the video and maybe shout out your Instagram or whatever it is that you need because I know most of my subscribers is crazy it's crazy as a sound don't have dreadlocks they just want dreadlocks you know today video you know I eat it, eat it. but we got to get to the today's video before we get into the video here is intro Today I'm gonna be showing you guys the process of going back to your black from bleach to black from bleach dreadlocks to your black or from dyed dreadlocks to your black dreadlocks. Cue the video. Let go. All right, guys. I'm about to get this hair dye out. So to do that, I showed you guys a hair remover that you guys are gonna be using uh, if you guys end up in the future re dyeing your hair or something like that. So let's get into it. It's very easy to dye your hair back to black if you have. You know, any color hair or whatever. This is the best way. The best way to do it. So I have a removal that removes hair color. Uh, it's called like a radical hair bleach or whatever like that. It, the link should be in the description for everything. And this is a developer right here. I use the 30 volume. Uh, people do recommend the 21. Uh, so not the 21, but the 21. Uh, so I just, I think the only mistake I made is that I put a lot than what I should have. Crazy thing is, 
You see how I pulled out those gloves from the back of the packet? I have never noticed that. I usually throw away the packet and try to read it out of the box. And this right here, the instruction manual, comes with the gloves in the back of it. And I was just really surprised by that. Shocked me. But uh, yeah, so like I said, uh, everything would be in the link in the description. So if you guys want to order from Amazon uh, and then get it to where you guys remove your uh, hair color uh, first before you bleach another color or dye it. Uh, and I, I, I recommend this if you already have a color that's set in already and uh, if you guys want to take that out co that color out and go to a different color I recommend that you first take or remove the hair color that you already got on your dreadlocks or on your hair so right here you can see me uh, with the slow motion uh, showing you guys that I am setting everything inside and outside of it I'm squeezing it in and then I'm squeezing it out and I was able to do it easily with the ponytail and grabbing a few hairs and grabbing it down the ones that I that I touched up would be laid down and the ones I didn't touch up would be in a ponytail and it got a little tricky at this point right here because you know working the way towards the back of your head is kinda harder than the front of your head so what I started doing was I kinda leaned my head a little bit to the right and got it uh, to where it was like easier for me to get the dreadlocks done and put it down because I didn't want it to touch the roots or anything like that and you have to be careful not to touch your roots because this this is this may be a removal almost like a bleach and I set in the timer for 45 minutes 30 to 45 minutes is where recommended but I was just like eyeing it out and nothing was really happening just a little bit of it got you know got taken out uh, but I'll tell you this man if you were setting it the right way as a packet says I read the packet but I kind of ignored it and that's the mistake that I really made and I usually don't make these mistakes I usually go by the signs of it so right here I have this fade resistant dark and lovely a color and uh, it's a jet black and then it comes with these things right here and that you have to mix the bottle with this liquid thing that comes with it and that's the that's the dye right there so right here you guys see me doing the same process as I was removing my uh, bleach as I was removing my blue dye I was doing the same process for that for the dyeing of the hair so I put it in a ponytail and dye it one by one and right here you see me rubbing it towards the to towards the root because some of the Roots had been touched up with the uh, blue before, so I just had to make sure that everything was black, like all my hair. And I didn't care if I it got to my scalp uh, because nobody can really see my scalp anyways. I don't like to show my scalp. Even when I get a retwist, I'm, I'm like, ugh, I don't want my scalp to be shown. I'm done with everything. Let me show you guys once this dry off. So my dreadlocks look just like this. I don't know if you guys liking it. If you guys liking it, make sure you let me know in the comments. If you're not digging it, just let me know also. Like, you're not digging it. You're, you know what I'm saying? I did a 23 months video update. 24 months is coming up, like two years. But this is my hair. How long my hair is? Jesus. Jesus. I know that a lot of people didn't expect the black dreadlocks, you know, to come. But it's like, I wanted to go back to here so badly. Like, I was like, like I miss having a black dreadlock like my original color like you know because i never had a rock like that the first day i literally bleached the first day i got my dreadlocks i got it bleached in the tips so i wanted to go back to black dreadlocks and the conditioner make it smell really really good the conditioner i used yeah if you guys don't like the vibe man let me know man if you guys like dang bro you should have kept the blue you know the blue look good or whatever a lot of people are saying like this may go to green. To be honest with you, I do agree on some certain part of the hair it would go green. Just because the bleach is set in there and also the blue is still set in there. Thank you guys for watching this video. But till next time, keep acting the verse and creating your universe. If you guys are digging this black hairstyle, let me know in the comments below. Make sure you DM me your pictures. If you want to make it to a top 10 dreadlocks. If you want to make it to my intros that you do in my intros, then send me videos on my Instagram and I'm going to check them out. I'm going to make sure you make it. Because I want to give it back to you guys 20k coming up Make sure you guys subscribe Share it like You guys have to do these things That I'm telling you guys If you want me to make it Really as 20k You guys have to like And comment Comment Really boosts up the algorithm Like like crazy Twice the like And then like also Boosts the algorithm also So if you guys want to help me out With those Please like You can say banger You can say just some little thing In the comment One thing in the comment That's it Or you can share my video To your Instagram Or uh, to your friend Or whatever that is That helps me out tremendously But till next time Keep acting the verse and credit on the universe. I'm act the verse and I'm out. 20.